Dear kids, welcome to our online class. So, um, on the sequence of our online classes for uh, our coming, uh, you know, for the next syllabus. So, uh, once again, I am going through the Active English Workbook as we have started with the workbook. So, I thought that it would be wise to complete the workbook first. I mean, not to complete, actually to, um, to go through the uh, Active English Workbook more. So, uh, on this sequence, I have chosen uh, one more topic and it is from your page 47. Earlier, I told you that we are going to start from the very last page of the Active English Workbook. That's why um, on the previous class, we have solved uh, 48, number 48. Now, it is time for page number 47. So, it is number 30, item number 38. Okay, it is item number 38 and page number 47. So, uh, on the uh, earlier class, we have uh, seen uh, it was about some of the basic speaking tests. It is about some of the basic question answer session that uh, if it is about what and if it is about is there, you know, the question pattern is about is there, how we will write the answers or if it is about what, if it starts with what, then how we will put the answer. So, to now, uh, on page number 47, it is something different. It is about months year and days i know you are very familiar with the name of the months so how many months are there in a year we know the 12 months and what are the name the names of the 12 months are number one is january to february march april may june july august september and october november and December. So there are in total 12 months in a year. That means that 12 months make a successful year. Okay. So what's the month is it now? It is July. So you will have some of the questions related such you know year, year uh, days or week or months. Okay. So how many days make, uh, make a month? 30 days or 31 days and sometimes it is 28 days okay uh, let me tell you 28 days is basically uh, it is about february but if it is about 29 days then it becomes a leap year got it that means if the february contains you know carries 29 days that means this february in this year is called a leap year but basically uh, as usual we have to only 28 days in February. So, in your uh, Active English Workbook, please, I would like to ask you to have your Active English Workbook with you along with your pencil, okay, and rubber, so that whatever I am uh, indicating, you can just quote it in your into your book. So, see, uh, let us go through the page that there are 12 months in a year look at the box of the top of your page there are the name of the uh, months and the days are also mentioned here january february march april may june july august september october november and december so how many months are there in a year see if uh, if you are given the question that how many how many months in a year okay in a year how many months okay let me rub this board so that i can give you a clear view so uh, if the question is like how many months are there in a year that means you have to mention the months how many months and if you are given such blanks uh, you know blank places so you can sense that you have to put a whole sentence like how many months if it is about how then what we how can we will start we will start with there okay so there then observer there are why it is are because see a uh, month so months there are so many months it is about plural number that's why i have put r here there are how many months 12 months in a year okay so see uh, in this way you have to put the answer 
now coming to the next that it is about that how many months make a year if uh, you are being asked that how many days make a month basically 30 or 31 days now you have to uh, you know you have to learn how many days make a january or how many days make february how many days make march and so on okay so for you this uh, answers the box is already given here and you have to learn that how many um, days make different months so now coming to the next part that uh, you know uh, the name of the months how many days it's gone now uh, what about if you are uh, if you are given some of the blanks like fill in the blanks we we will give you uh, the very first letter of a name and you have to fill up the last uh, the rest of the words like let me show you this so if you are given a, uh, if you are given uh, the questions like fill in the blanks uh, about the months actually especially about the month say the number one is blank so the number the very first month of a year is january so you have to put january is here uh, say uh, now you are given only the first letter of the second month and it is f it is f uh, what of the month that what is the month that it starts with f it is february so f is already been given here so you have to put the rest of the letters like february f e b r u a r y february then m is here then the rest of the uh, letters are march m a r c H, March then it is April A P R I L April then the number 5 is after April what comes it is May then J is here so you have to put U A N E it means June then after June what comes it is July then the A is here so you have to put U G U S T what does it make it is August it is not August it is August okay the number nine is after august what is it it is september okay see uh you can now ask me that means you are giving the clues uh some of in uh on some of the blanks you are giving clues and the rest of the uh, are not uh, are without clues why is it so it is so because we have we uh would like to test you right you that you may you f uh, follow the clue or not okay it is just a simple thing it is nothing serious so if you are uh, if you if you are uh, you you can notice the very first letter then it is of course uh, it is very easier to you to uh, you know put the rest of the letters only but if it is about a whole blank i think it is not uh, also a major thing you can also you already know the sequences of the name of the month so after september it it's october so you can put it directly okay no matter we are giving you the clue or not if you are familiar with the name of the months you can put it in any way then after october it is november and the last month of a year what it is it is december okay so in this way uh, in your book you can see some of the blanks so you have to put the name of the uh, months but if you are given the clue so you have to put the rest of the letters only but if you are not given any clue then you have to put the whole name by, with your own conscience okay so now i would like to give you one more uh, some of the more questions though these questions are not into your book but i'm just giving you to test your uh, iq that you are uh, whether you can catch it or not one so see the first uh, i'm giving you some of the questions please have a look on the board that what is the first month in a year what is the first month january is the first month now i would like to give you a tip that uh, see uh, i always want you to complete the sentence but if it is not possible if you find it very difficult or very uh, you know uh, with limited time so you can only put the name of the month okay just you can put the uh, can put the name of the month you don't need to uh, complete the sentence like what is the first month in a year it's january you can only put january or if you want that yeah i would like to complete the sentence then you can write the whole sentence like january is the first month of uh, year or in a 
year. Okay? I don't mind whether you just uh, indicate the January or uh, or you can uh, or you write the whole sentence. The number two, see, if I ask you that, uh, what is the last month of a year? What is the last month? Count, count right now. Guess what is the last month? Of course, the last month is what? December. Too much misty and too much cold month. Then the number three, see, if I ask you that what is the month now? The current month is what? It is July. So you can just put the name of the month. Okay. So in this way you can answer. If uh, I am not uh, telling it is about all about your exam. But it is for your better knowledge. Okay. So now coming to the next part. So now I would like to uh, give you uh, the hints on that how many uh, days make uh, the specific month from starting with the January. See, uh, you can you can use your hand also. See the upper portion of the joints is uh, starting with this January, February. Whatever the joints, that means the upper level of this joint indicates the months this are actually about 31 days okay it is 31 it is not it is 31 it is not it is 31 it is not in this way see january february march april that means january is 31 days february is not then march is 31 days april is not okay so january february march april may june july august okay july and august both are about 31 days okay july august then again what september october november december okay once again let us uh, have a look on this january the upper portion what indicates it is about 31 days january february 31 not 31 not 31 not so in this way january february march april may june july August, September, October, November, and the last month of a year is December. So, how many how many days actually make our December? It is thirty one days undoubtedly, and of course, it is thirty one days. Okay. So, uh, again, starting with see January thirty one, February is not. Then March is thirty one, April is not, May is thirty one. June is not okay then July is 31 and August is also 31 September is not October is 31 November is not and the last month December is of course about 31 days because we celebrate 31st night okay at the very last day of a of a year so let us uh, have a look on the board I have already mentioned the days okay see January January is 31 days, February is 28 days, March is 31 days, April 30 days, May 31 days, June 30 days, July 31, August 31, September 30, October 30, November 30, sorry, October 31, November 30 and December 31, okay. So all this are month and one more thing is that I have told you that uh, uh, February doesn't contain, never con contains actually 31 days or 30 days. Uh, it is only about 28 days. If it is 28 days, it is very natural. Uh, basically, February is the only month that contains uh, the less uh, days uh, other than the uh, other, you know, uh, months. It is about 28 days, but sometimes it is about one more day. Uh, that is 29 days. Sometimes 29 days make February and if is about 29 days then of course it is a leap year the year in a year if the february contains 29 days then it becomes a leap year and what is leap year after every four years there's a leap year 
ओके सो आई होप यू गॉट द आइडिया एंड ऑन यू ऑन द पेज फोर्टी सेवन देयर इज सम ऑफ द ब्लैंक्स अबाउट मंथ्स द लेट द लास्ट पार्ट ऑफ अबाउट डेज वी वील डिस्कस इट ऑन द नेक्स्ट क्लास बट द फर्स्ट पोर्शन ऑफ दिस पेज इज अबाउट मंथ्स एंड ईयर्स सो प्लीज go through the book and put the answers into the book uh, we will meet with uh, the new topic that means the last part of 47 so till then take care and stay well